Well, what a year it's been, facing the aftermath of peak pandemic times, yet dealing with the restrictions put in place to continue keeping our service users and staff safe. The landscape of the period, March 2021 to April 22, was an unpredictable one. In such uncertain and worrying times, however, our main focus remained clear, keeping Seaview open as a safe place for those who needed us most. We kicked off the start of our financial year with the Woodland Project as part of the Wilding Festival, an experience that allowed surface users facing the chaos of everyday life to reconnect with nature and ease up lockdown. The events that followed included painting the prom, the launch of our men's group and women's group, our new radar-led wellness group aimed at working through the five ways to wellbeing, the Now You See Me project, Broom Britannia with Barefoot Opera, the Big Sleep Bubble and our carol concert. Throughout, staff continued to give over and above in the centre and on the street, being unwavering with their support. The early morning outreach shift started at 5am, verifying people sleeping rough checking on their welfare while bedded down and encouraging them to come into the centre for support. Our recovery teams, too, continuing to reach those that others do not, reaching out and offering opportunities to step onto a pathway of support. Furthermore, we opened up weekends during the winter, offering support and warmth during the cold, dark months. Rain or shine, our mission statement is to work with people who feel like they're living on the margins of society. We believe everyone has an inherent potential to thrive. And with the continued support of our fundraisers, volunteers, local organisations and staff, we're able to keep on doing so and we cannot thank all our supporters enough. As we face another wave of uncertainty with the cost of living crisis, we recognise we can get through almost anything as we pull tight and work together in the CV way. Our aim will be to ensure our service users are not left behind and continue to access the services they need.